Hi, thanks for caring about important issues, specifically women's rights. To date, there has been over 100,000 terrorist attacks against women's clinics or health clinics. Over 100,000 terrorist attacks um, by religious extremists in most cases. Um, this is a serious issue and I want to address it as a man um, since many men are attacking these women and their rights. Um, first, I'll start with a story. Um, my aunt, who is now 50 years old, still wears a diaper, crawls, can't talk, drools, um, needs a diaper, and needs constant 24-7 care. My grandparents are very elderly and still caring for her. They have cost it taxpayers millions and millions of dollars. This is not quality of life in any means. Uh, and I respect their choice to keep her if that's what they want it. Um, but I respect other people's choice to terminate a pregnancy if they know that this is going on, which they in fact knew through ultrasounds um, at the time and the umbilical cord was around the neck. Um, this was in the third trimester. Um, unlike most abortions, over 90% or nearly all well over 90% are done in the first weeks after the embryo is fertilized. First weeks. Um, so it's barely beyond the embryo stage. I would suggest that a shrimp or an ant, which is aware, conscious, able to suffer, and even runs for, in fear, is more of a life than a embryo that has barely been fertilized. Um, and I've studied psychology, the brain development. Their bodies are transparent because they are not formed. You can see right through them as well as the head. Um, again, I studied psychology and the development of the human brain and body. Um, so um, they actually protested Sophia Longoria, I believe, for having frozen embryos. And this made national news because um, they made such a stink about it. Um, so um, are we putting embryos over women's right to choose is getting absurd. So as a man, I think we need more men speaking out about this. Um, my second issue, after I shared my aunt's story, is um, human overpopulation. It is real. Look at China, the smog, 15-lane highways, endangered species, extinctions, our rainforest being, being torn down. Um, human up overpopulation is real. We have millions of people with unmet human needs. Let's worry about them um, over embryos and weak old fetuses. Um, so um, human overpopulation is real. Um, our landfills are filling up, lack of resources, water is being polluted, um, so many issues. Um, I can't believe that this is a precedence for the GOP and Republican and conservative parties. I, in fact, am libertarian, which is for small government without um, religious influence, as I sum it up. Um, so um, the next issue is birth control access. Colorado has given out free birth control and it's put abortions down 40% and saved taxpayers millions of dollars on welfare. Um, I mean, not everyone can afford birth control. How do you think they can afford to raise a child? Uh, birth control um, should be covered in people's insurance. It's not always the case. And the other issue is birth control is not always 100% effective. No, abstinence is extreme. Um, if they want to give in to their urges, and or I am married myself, we do not want a child. If we did, we would adopt. So um, birth control is not always 100% um, uh, foolproof. And also, um, not everyone wants a child, and you can't force someone to be a parent. But birth control, giving it out for free, will save taxpayers tons of money. That's where religion comes into play. They Many religions don't want birth control access for everyone. Um, but the next issue is religion and adoption. Um, many gays are willing to adopt, but they oppose to that too. Many of the pro-life, pro-birth movement, um, religious influenced. Uh, there's currently over 450,000 children and teenagers in foster care that we're footing the bill for, and they do not um, help in any way. That would be like a vegan 
um, not adopting a dog and going to a breeder or a puppy mill or a store. Makes zero sense. Um, adopt those children if you want to be taken seriously. Over 450,000 in the United States alone. Um, so we cannot regulate women's bodies. Um, next, are they going to want to make it illegal to smoke or drink while they're pregnant? Um, you can't tell people what to do. You can't force them to carry for nine months and then they can't work a jo certain jobs. It has so many impacts on people's lives. Um, most are done in the first weeks, again, of the embryo stage fertilization. Um, if we want to split hairs and uh, you want to um, debate the topics, go to the comments. Um, again, they've committed over 100,000 terrorist acts on women's clinics. We need to speak out against them. A police officer was killed at a Planned Parenthood clinic this past year um, that was responding to the terrorist attack. And these drama queens have generated so many lies. Um, again, nearly all are done in the first weeks of the first trimester. Um, a lot of lies going on, um, showing partial birth or whatever, and Carly Fiorina lies, and a lot of the Republican men. Um, please do some research for yourself if you're concerned, or just don't have one. If you choose 